Purdue basketball tradition is really up there with everyone's. You know, I had a chance to spend about an hour with Gene today and uh, came by during our shoot around and uh, he's one of the guys I, I respect the most in basketball and uh, brought my team over to meet him and just told him, uh, he didn't talk to the team by the way, still cheered for Purdue and all that. But I, I told him, it would, I told our team it's going to be an honor for us to play on KD Court. You know, because for 25 years he's represented this university in the very best fashion. And Matt is, is carrying that on. You know, uh, I thought our defense was really good tonight. And obviously, obviously our rebounding was excellent. Uh, our kids played real hard and our kids played hard. And, you know, we just rebounded a little bit better and more. Uh, any questions that y'all might have? A lot of teams look at you guys as a measuring stick. And this would have been the biggest win on this campus, non conference, in a long, long time. Where would you measure Purdue at, vice versa? No, we, we think, you know, from, I mean, they're the best team by far that we've played. And uh, like I told our team that they would challenge North Carolina's at a little bit different level in our, you know, because they have everybody back. But, you know, Purdue would be there with anybody, with us. I mean, if we, we play Purdue a number of times, they're, they're going to beat us too. You know, and uh, so we think at the, end of the, at the end of the season, Purdue will be one of those teams that has a chance. And uh, that's why we looked at it. Our, our kids were very ready to play. And, and you know, we've got to get accustomed to playing in, in these environments. Our veterans are because you know, it's usually the way it is wherever we play. And it's a sign of respect. So I'm glad they were able to do it in the first game like that this year. Well, I thought that um, you know, we just never got off to a, a good start. I thought early in the game um, we had some careless turnovers and um, had some shots not go down for them and we hurried some things. And I uh, just never really got off to a good start. I thought we were very fortunate um, to be down eight and a half. I thought they had totally outplayed us. We had nine turnovers in the first half. I mean, obviously, when you turn the basketball over, at times you, I think you can miss some shots when you're too eager to to make plays and do some things. But we, we didn't make some simple plays on the break, just passing and catching type stuff. And, uh, I, I think uh, you can't make excuses when it comes to that. When you have to be productive in catching the basketball and uh, not turn the ball over if you weren't productive in that area. We have skilled guys. And uh, we know we're not going to go out and dominate anybody physically right now. But we have to do a better job of playing physical basketball. And we have to make strides in that area. But if we're going to go out and shoot the ball like we did right now, we have a skilled team, then we're going to struggle. Um, we can shoot the ball a lot better than, than we did tonight. But with that being said, you, and I keep getting back to it because you, you, we got to get credit where credit's due. Um, Duke took us out of that. They, they knocked those guys out, and they made it tough for them to, um, to get into the flow offensively.